now let's start creating the another section which is a intro video and um, let's start first of all i'm going to open this page uh, into editor which is gutenberg editor and also there is a little uh, changes that i would like to change uh, inside the hero area if i take a look at the design here you can see the image uh, placed at the right side um, not exactly right but it's uh, something uh, right if i click uh, the image here and click here to change the alignment so i just click the align right from here and it plays at the right side if i click update and reload the page now as you can see the image is just placed at the right side and it's working as expected now there is a little change that uh, inside our code that we have added previously which is a css code we have added here under the image let's take a look at here and as you can see align right the class is added here align right now if i take a look at closely uh, the image remove uh, bottom space margin bottom zero and um, basically it doesn't work as expected because it's coming with the align right so i have to select um, here because i have added align right and i have to create again and add figure fig or figure then img so you can simply copy the uh, code margin bottom zero it's padding i think i'm not sure why it's not working so it should be remove image bottom space remove image bottom space and then figure and then image it should work but i'm not sure exactly why it doesn't work let's remove the image from here <laughs> very strange well it's not working okay i think i should also try to use the class which is align right yes the align right is uh, selected the exact uh, image that i would like to remove the margin bottom here now if i go to dashboard and then click custom css to add some custom css here i can also okay i can use this one at this moment right here now reload the page well now it looks perfect uh, at this moment so if i start making the next section let's copy the text from here and another thing that um, i would like to change globally which is the font family 16 pixel the font the typography uh, the body font size is 16 pixel let's take a look if is there any options inside the editor to change the global typography here so i'm going to click on the style and typography and text so here i can change it to pixel and let's change it to 16 pixel and i think it looks perfect if i do want to do the same thing just for the link i can also change it from here to 16 and now it looks similar so i don't have to change the font size again and again uh, for individual uh, section and block item now i just reload the home page well now let's start creating this section here copy and the font size is 16 regular uh, source series pro now you can always start with a uh, there's two options you can always start with a, a cover or you can always start with um, it's actually depends on your requirement so you can uh, you can use 
um, group or you can use uh, cover like the section that I have created uh, the hero area now if I go to home page again so for this design let's complete this uh, first section here and there is no need to use cover and I can use at this moment simply the group options I'm going to copy the text from here also and the font size is 48 pixel let's make it center and heading h2 would be perfect and let's change it to the 48 pixel well let's make it center and change the font height to semi bold I, I just start changing a little bit faster because I think you already know how things work and how to change um, something from here easily now if I open the list view here as you can see the list view which is displaying paragraph heading and paragraph again but there is no need paragraph we can make them as a group so if I select here if I select any uh, block from here I can easily uh, change the paragraph icon to open other uh, block which is refers to transform to heading group buttons so you can change the view so I'd like to click group and when I click on group here you can see the paragraph is only added into the group I would like to use heading inside the same group here just drag it and drop it here and you can also just uh, click over here and uh, you can ungroup them you can duplicate the group uh, you can add something before group and after group also so using group you can also uh, add some more additional um, options or because it allows you or it increase uh, some more features inside your editor so when I select group at the right side here you can see the block you can change the content width so I'd like to change it to 1000 because currently there is no options uh, to change it uh, globally uh, you cannot define it hopefully they will uh, introduce this kind of features in the future now for the padding I would like to add a padding top 90 pixel and let's keep it a 90 pixel top at this moment uh, I can also decrease the padding uh, I think 90 pixel is way bigger 70 would be perfect at this moment under this section uh, here you can see there is an image with icon and uh, you that means it refers uh, video so you can directly uh, paste any YouTube video here or uh, if you want to use any pop-up then you can also use any pop-up here as well now if I search here YouTube here you can see you can just uh, add any YouTube video so if you if I visit my channel from here and copy any video uh, from the YouTube let's copy this one and copy go to editor and paste it here click embed now the video looks like this so you can use a directly YouTube video here uh, you can also make it full width if you want and also you can change the width to uh, wide width as well so if you click on update it looks like this just reload the page scroll down and here you can see the video but if you do not want to use uh, the video exactly similar to this one then you can simply remove here and here you can see um, the cover I think it doesn't require 1000 pixel at this moment there is no need to in, uh, increase it so I can always uh, use uh, inherit default layout also if I click on update let's take a look how it looks with the a current uh, version here it looks like this so if I click on inherit default layout and click on update and reload the page you can see it just uh, plays as it 
uh, with some default widths if i inspect here to understand exactly what is the default uh, width here so here you can see the group uh, default width is uh, something like that uh, there is uh, if i choose the block group six i'm sorry the default is 650 pixel here but uh, it's not necessary to make it hide uh, full void at this moment that's why i'm uh, using the inherit default layout well let's create the next uh, part here simply i would like to upload this image here so i can select cover and upload I can simply reduce the opacity here and upload the icon as image here is the icon and make it center it's done so you can also change the width um, of this uh, section I would like to use max width 1000 click on update and reload the page here now as you can see it looks like this but uh, it doesn't look uh, perfect because the width is 1000 pixel but it's bigger than 1000 pixel and we can simply uh, just convert this cover into group and after that we can change the width to 1000 pixel manually from here and then we can add some uh, padding bottom here to make it a little bit uh, separation uh, 70 pixel and click on update and then reload the page now as you can see it looks perfect now so i hope after watching this video you'll be able to create a section looks like this exactly uh, on your server thank you so much for watching this video have a good day bye